We're going to talk about theory of adding first before I talk about how the actual code looks. There's a big x equals change x idea that we have to use, so I recommend you watch a few of these videos before you jump into the code. And we're going to look right now just at the theory of where in the world would a 14 be added to this tree. All right, so we're going to add a 14. How in the world do we do it? Well, like every method, we're going to start at the root and then decide what to do next. So I see there's an 8 in the root. It's probably smart to use a contains check before you add, just to make sure 14's not in this tree. We can look at the tree and say, hey, 14's not in it, no big deal, but it's probably good to run uh, contains just to see if 14's in there, because if 14's already in there, you don't want to add it. All right, so if 14's not in there, we need to figure out where should it go. So we're looking at the root. Where should 14 go? It's bigger than the root, so 14 should go to the right. So we're going to look at 11. So 14 is bigger, so we're going to go to the right again. 19, okay. So 19, we're trying to put a 14 in here, so 14 is smaller than 19. So where should it go? Right now there's an empty spot right here where 14 is going to go. So that's where we're going to put 14. Okay. How about a 3? Now how do you actually add? Well when you're dealing when you have this node it won't have if it doesn't have a left child that 14 you're going to make a new node that will become the left child so now we're going to add a three so where does three go let's get rid of these circles so now we're going to check at the overall root we want to add a three so it's small so we go to the left we want to add a three it's small go to the left all right now we just want to add a three but two is no longer smaller or 2 is smaller, so 3 is bigger. So now we're going to go to the right, and now we're looking at 4, and finally we can add 3, and 3 is going to go here. So that's where 3 would go. All right, what about a 7? we got a problem, because seven's already in there, so we're not going to add a 7. Uh, let's see. I think... Yep, so I think that covers a lot of the add cases. Uh, you basically keep, you look at whatever your current node is, and you either go left or right, depending on if the value you want to add is greater than or less than the current node. And when you find that uh, there is no left or there is no right, meaning the left or right is null, then you would put, you create a new node with that value and put that on the left or the right of the current node. Doing that's a little trickier. Uh, in code than talking about doing it. So I just want to warn you.